Welcome to CAD Tutorials and in this video I'll be covering practice problem 9.8. Now given this voltage which is applied to a capacitor of value 50 microfarads we are asked to find the current which flows through it and for a capacitor by now you know that I is equal to C dV divided by dt. Now differentiation in the complex form results in JW and the variable of interest. Now our variable of interest is V, so this transforms into JWV. So the phasor form of our current is equal to C, J, W, V, and the value of C is 50 micro. So 50 multiplied by 10 to the minus six, then we have our J, then we have W, which you're gonna take from this because this is the place where we find in the general form of a sinusoid, this is where we found our omega, which is W, right? So we are going to substitute this value of 100. And here we are interested in finding our voltage, our, sorry, our current. And we're given this voltage in sinusoidal form, which you can uh, transform into a phasor with magnitude 10 and phase 30. So magnitude 10 and phase 30. Now I can just basically punch all of this into a calculator to find the result. So the result then would be 50 times 10 to the minus six, right? Multiplied by J, multiplied by 100, then finally multiplied by 10 with an angle of 30 degrees, and the result of that is this, transform it into a polar form, and we have 0 0.05 with an angle of 120, so 0.05 with an angle of 120 degrees. Now we can transform this into milliamperes and say, what would this be if we divide it by a thousand, right? So this would be 50 because 50 divided by 1000 would be something like that, which is gonna result in 50 divided by 100, which is of this form. So the result is there for 50 with an angle of 120 milliamperes.